All right, ladies and gentlemen, y'all already know what time it is, man. If you like the video, like the video, subscribe for more daily 2K content, and let's get right into it. NBA 2K21, we got a lot of information for y'all, man. But if you don't do nothing else, make sure you hit the like button and subscribe, man. We dropping the 2K heat every day of the week. Uh, we streaming every day on YouTube, man, Twitch, trying to grow this thing, man. Also, man, check it out. I got myself a brand new, um, I got myself a brand new Ryzen 9 laptop. And I got this joint the other day, right? And as such, I am trying to sell my my HP Omen. This is a HP Omen gaming laptop. It's got a 1660 Ti in it. It's got a uh, what a, 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 a i9, a i7, a 97, 97, 9750H in it. 16 gigs of RAM. All this stuff. I still got the original box. All the original accessories. I'm gonna put the exact model number down in the in the description i got this joint for sale and i'm just letting y'all know i just bought myself a ryzen 9 laptop and um i'm actually digging this joint man so i, I bought this and since i'm digging this it's a smaller laptop because you know i do a lot of business or whatever and I, I do it and when i'm going into places this is the reason i'm selling there's nothing wrong with it. it's in pristine condition it's about a year old uh this is one that's like the little, little stealth bomber joint but when i go into a place and i'm working and I pop this joint up like this, it's like the first thing they say is, yo, you're a gamer, you know, it's a gaming laptop or whatever. This is also a gaming laptop and it's, it's probably the most powerful gaming laptop that you can get dang near, uh, cause it got a Ryzen 9 in it. But, you know, uh, it just looks more clean and more uniform and all that stuff as far as when I go into an office. That's the only reason I'm selling this joint, man. So if you're interested, uh, hit me up in the DM or what have you. Uh, I'll ship it to you overnight. Like I said, I got all the original stuff with it. Um, it's got a, you know, I leave the link link to it uh, down in the description or what have you. So that way y'all can see all the specs and all that. Shameless plug. But uh, hit me up on Instagram. Hit me up on Twitter. I'm going to sell it for like, you know, 800, 900, something like that. Maybe some type of offer, man. I paid like what? to 1400 for it or something like that it was crazy when i bought it uh, about a year ago but it's a top of the line laptop hit me up if you're interested uh other than that man uh let's just get right into the video it's been long enough there you go if you make it to c25 that's og status i was told you could be anything just don't be average down bad flat pipes that shit made me sad start hustling non-stop don't plan on breaking that habit and like I said, I'm not sure if I said it, but I'm shipping that joint overnight, man. So uh, y'all, y'all make sure y'all hit that up, man. First and first and foremost, bro, listen. Uh, you know, we we've been playing this game for a little bit, and everybody's enjoying it. And I know I've been I've not been around in the capacity uh, that I should have been. And I am gonna be I'm gonna be around a lot more as we get going. But uh, first first item of news for the day, man. Your boy Duke Dennis said he's back. And uh, you know, he just he just said it very plain. Uh, we'll be done moving moving in my new crib today. Can't wait so I can get start get so I can start back grinding. And uh, you know, that's all that's all it is, man. You know, that's what this thing is about. It's about grinding during the time that nobody else wants to grind. This is the perfect time to try to grind and get yourself rolling and get yourself moving. I'm about to actually get back to the grind right now, and I'm about to um I'm about to stream. And uh, you know, stream this. Uh, what do we got? We got the uh, the Kia event or what have you, uh, which is up next. Which is what I had up next. Which Shakedown was talking about. Uh, this is what's up uh, today and tomorrow. We got the Kia challenge all day Wednesday up until 3 a.m. on Thursday morning. I'm going to be streaming that joint until it's over with, pretty much. Me, Brute, and Gambit. We're gonna be trying to do that. And then we got the Mobile One Grand Prix tomorrow at 5 p.m. So thankfully we actually get a little bit of a rest in this joint, man, because when I'm telling you I am tired because I have been grinding, grinding on this game, trying to hit legend and do my thing and get these videos out to y'all and actually enjoy some time with my family and stuff. Hit the like button for me putting out videos every day, bro. But I've been, I've been trying to get myself together and get myself ready for this year because this year, bro, we dropping videos. I'm gonna be dropping, like I said, I know they're saying people not really watching videos and stuff like that i'm about to be dropping heller videos that ain't nobody watching then because i'm actually i've been playing call of duty i've been hooping on call of duty man i'm putting up like 30 a game out there since they relaxed the skill-based matchmaking and i'm not fighting the, the mighty morphin power rangers seal team six and the damn avengers at the same time uh, and the justice league all at the same time meanwhile they're giving me spongebob squidward and and the care bears 
and 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 me and my wife out there trying to carry teams and they don't even want to play let me know if the skill based matchmaking is ridiculous in call of duty but anyway like i said bro we got you know uh hopefully this is going to be one of those games where i'm able to grind on and we able to do some stuff like that and really grow this year bro because every time the game is slow and people really don't like it that's where we at and one of the reasons that people really don't like the game bro is is, is one of the things that i'm about to show you so we got nba 2k lab right and they put out a video and they're talking about how um intimidator this is current gen now it's how intimidator impacts the game or what have you and they're saying that if you have intimidator you have uh, you you know it, it, it gives you a much needed boost to shot contest and things like that so if you if you got intimidator it helps you to, it helps you contest shots but it's con it's intimidator combined with uh perimeter defense if you just got intimidator you got low perimeter defense it's not really going to help you but if you have intimidator and you have high perimeter defense it's, it's, it's gonna help you a lot and that's crazy because that's like people have been saying that you know perimeter defense don't matter it never has mattered and like interior defense and we already proved that that's a lie because my dog me and my dog nba 2k 2 is kind of collaborated to on this video you know well collaborated meaning i i asked him to do it and uh because he did the interior and uh i asked him to do let's see if in perimeter means anything and he did it and then we found out that perimeter defense don't mean anything as far as the shot contest it's your block rating and all of that stuff and so like that really brings us to why a lot of people are having a lot of issues with this game because there's no clear i mean i got a whole video that i'm gonna do about this but the longer the short of it is we don't know what these defensive badges do even if you read the tool tips and stuff like that right it's hard to find out what these defense what these defensive badges will do uh how they work and how all this stuff like like, like clamps clamps say it help you stay in front of people but it doesn't help you get no cut, cut off animations and stuff like that it just really makes you immune to to weak ass size ups and stuff that's what it should say you'll be uh and Brute brute definitely can't finish with one finishing bad badge in the game but it's just one of those things where it's just like the gist of my video that i'm gonna be putting out later today is why is it that every offensive badge appears to work but none of the defensive badges appear to work you know what i'm saying like like the only ones that really work what like box might work a little bit uh but that's not even a defensive badge rebound chaser works obviously and then what's the other badge uh box rebound and uh brick wall but those are technically just rebounding and offensive badges it's insane so it's like we don't even know what these defensive badges really do like clamps it says helps you stay in front of somebody but you get better cutoff animations with silver clamps than you do with with hall of fame clamps but if you have hall of fame clamps you won't get hit by the curvy size up and, and the bs so much so it's just one of those things where it's just like we don't really understand what's going on and we need more clarification and and hopefully 2k will give us that but it's just like when people lie and these other youtubers they just blatantly lie about it's always been this way and you never needed this you know bro they just prove 2k lab just showed you just now last gen the same nba 2k 21 in current gen perimeter defense was just as important as intimidator but in this gen intimidator and your block rating are way more important than uh than than perimeter well as far as making people miss shots they are more important than uh than than uh, perimeter defense perimeter defense just helps you stay in front of people and helps you move laterally and it seems like that really don't even matter and it's and it's also a function of speed so your perimeter defense is only as high as your speed can be and your lateral quickness blah 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 yakety smackety it is what it is man but like i said it's tough to really it's tough to really figure out what's what we should be doing or what we shouldn't be doing because it really feels like none of the defensive stats let me know if i'm wrong it feels like almost damn near like all of the offensive stats, stats matter and all of those badges matter but the defensive stats don't even matter it, it really feels like defensive stats don't even matter like you're sitting there and you're putting the stats on and you're like why do i even got this stat up now don't get me wrong we know ankle braces and all those things are very important and they do work but i'm just saying like like i said we it seems like all the offensive badges work and precious few of the defensive badges work the way that we think that they should or what have you but y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section am i right am i wrong do, do i just need you know like like i said we know ankle braces works but because if you don't have it on you're gonna be swimming all day long and, and you're gonna in the concrete swimming pool right but if you got them on you're still gonna get broke you're just not gonna get broke as much 
like I said, clamps, it just, it kind of keeps you centered in front of the person and it, and it keeps you from moving when they do the curvy and stuff like that. It's just stuff like that. But I thought clamps should be able to help you cut people off more and stuff like that. And then strength don't even help you cut people off is what they say. But my guy got max strength and I feel like I'm cutting people off. I don't know, bro. Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section, man. Um, let me know if y'all want it. Uh, my Instagram and Twitter is all down in the comment section. If you want the computer, you could actually tell me that you want it and pay for it. Send me your information up until 10 o'clock, up until 9.30 tonight. I can get it out and uh, I can next day and you'll actually have it tomorrow. So if, you, if you're interested, let me know. And I'm out of town next time. Till next time. It's your boy Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BK, the People's Champ. Guys, please.